Today's telecast is being presented live from Los Scandalous Shake and Bake Arena. And Bricks, we've got some major star sightings today. Oh, look, there's Tom Shanks. And there's Tyler Scary. And oh, oh, that's Jennifer Gorings. Wow. <laughs> Are those things real or fake, you think, Rem? Well, if you're talking about those two big chihuahuas she's holding, yep, they look real to me, Pop. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The new Gorland Zombies battle. The Los Scandalous Dam. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Welcome to another game day here on the MFL Network. Grim Blitzrow along with my partner, Brickhead Mulligan. How you doing? Great city, isn't it, Bricks? Fantastic city. My motel even has free color TV. Oh, that's and nice. an ice machine that works. Wow. That was police tape blocking the bathroom because of the photographers in there. But other than that, no complaints. They, they give you free jelly at breakfast, too. Sounds like a real winner. And it's first and ten. refuses to go down. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. And the defense gave up a lot of yards on that pass play. They'll need to regroup quickly. And that'll bring up third and one. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. Second down in a lot. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Third down and long. Look at him! And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. Nice punt! Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Hot one, hot two, hot three. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. <laughs> Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot Cannonball, first down. Yeah, my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Second down and ten. Hot, hot 
One, hot two, hot three. It's two yard run before he stopped. Third down and eight. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it, too. And it looks like the offense is desperate for a first down. Hot two. Oh, he's going berserk. Oh, man, Brooks, you've got to love a player who goes down fighting. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8, the greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Wow. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. Nice pick up for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Second down and two. First and ten. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one.
Third down and the punter is warming up. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. That's a four yard gain. Second down and six. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. He is automatic! Nice kick! Boring. Just getting the... And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. <laughs> Ballsy. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. You know, getting that first ref is kind of like fishing. Getting the first one seems to take forever, then they come in bunches. They'll probably come home with a stringer full of refs by the end of this game. <laughs> There's no reason to go for it here, but they do anyway. The, de the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. That play was like the offense was playing rock, paper, scissors, and the defense was playing rocket launcher. And now the defense has the ball because they came to play. And it's first and ten. First down! Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. I hope you covered your ears, Bricks, because that was a sonic blast dirty trick. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. First down to seven. And that's just a great run for a touchdown. Hey, you kill a ref. It's not murder if they have it coming, right? Take the hit. Do something about that ref, you pussies. First down and long, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Oh, and the ref just bought himself one more play of life with some moves that would put some of our Hall of Famers to shame. Oh, good. That gives me time to get odds on him. Someone give me a phone. First down and forever. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. And the defense just knocked the wind out of that quarterback. Ha, <laughs> ha, 
Football, a pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You know, they're all in politics, apparently. Third down and forever. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy one. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. Catches it for six yards. Good mitts on that play, Bricks. His fingers are like a bunch of sausages. And that'll be second down and four. Two minutes left in the half. And that'll be second down and four. It's a nice run for a first down. And they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blasphemy. Oh, with a punishing hit. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. Second down and five. He zings it in there for a four-yard gain. And that's the last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant reminder of our own mortality? Of that constant, relentless advance? And he shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down! First and ten. No, oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Third down and, well, good luck. Oh, with the brain scrambler. <laughs> and the hurry up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. The way to keep the chains moving that was beautiful and it's first and ten no receivers open so the qb just threw the ball away it's not short but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again hmm that's bleak bricks he's got the distance and the kick is good the 
second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh boy, where we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, gonna go to a strip tease show, where we going? And once you settle down, just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. <laughs> the teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Mincemeat out of that guy. Hey, what is mincemeat anyway? Is it like bologna? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna get a sandwich. Here comes the defense. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. The kicker died on that play. Oh, that's terrible. Now what do they do? Well, another player will assume the kicking role for the remainder of the game. The coach is praying he won't need a long field goal to win this one. And it's first and ten. Brick should it's a gain of seven yards on the catch. Nicely done. Second and three. Gets the ball. Get the first down and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. That's a six-yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. You can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up in my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. First down. And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Second down and a lot. First and ten. Great play by the
a defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. Sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he put all of his foot into that one. He just let that one drop and played safe, and the defense says, we'll take it. And it's first and ten. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. First down! He hit that line the way a rolled up dollar bill sticking out of flimsy Lohan's nose. It's a mare in Lost Wages, Nevada. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. He broke free and has open field in front of him. First and ten. The quarterback had no time to throw, and the defense gets a big sack. Second down, and ain't gonna happen, partner. run he nearly broke it open bricks yeah and i nearly blew three times the legal limit last night leaving the stadium and i nearly did not get arrested get thrown face first into a paddy wagon get taken for a rough ride and i nearly did not have prison sex and lockup last night nearly ain't a good thing grim trust me Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Just got crushed. And it's first and ten. Defense 
Adams holds him to a four-yard pickup there. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. Second down and six. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He can have the IQ of a rutabag after that hit. And it's first and ten. up a new set of downs and it's first and ten second down in a very lot That's a six-yard gain on that catch. Third down and nine. And he's able to trim that one somehow and hold on for the first down. They might consider calling a kill the ref play. Just saying. <laughs> Third down and long, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, We're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yep, the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick, and the QB is in a heap of trouble now. <laughs> not to do on fourth down. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, I love this dirty trick. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. First and ten. The ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong Il. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Now there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kicker's job in half? They just be called sinners there. Straight through the uprights.
They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. And it's first and ten. sleep permanently you snooze you lose unless you're in a sleeping contest and it's first and ten First and ten. That's a catch for a one-yard gain. That's not going to do it, fellas. Second down and nine. And that pass play is good for eight yards. Pussy here. Boom! And it's first and ten. And he picks up two yards on the catch. Only two minutes left in the game. And that'll be second and eight to go. And he picks up four on that pass and catch. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. And they run it in for two points. Man, those bones can boogie. The lack of muscle, fat, organs, and skin really makes it easy for them to dance. Side kicks the desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a possession. Still, it ain't right, Grim. It just ain't right. And he picks up maybe four on that play. And it's first and ten. And the 
QB might as well just bury himself now because boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, going in circles. Oh, nice hit. The offense has only two linemen left on the offense, and they'll need to play shorthanded the rest of the game. Hey, don't say me things about short people, Grim. At least they don't look down on people. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stupsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. And he catches it for a touchdown. What a beautiful play. point attempt. It's good. He'll be going onside here and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. The four people on the planet who care about rules and kickoffs must be happy to see a flag down. I'm just happy to see anything after that laser pointer accident. Looks like they're lined up for an onside kick. Uh, I thought they were going to do some sort of chorus line. They usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck. Which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. timeout, but they are running out of time. A uh, bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point. And drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. Uh. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown! Touchdown! I'm a And these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Grim. Yeah, bigger than yours. And he plows forward for the two-point conversion. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned out the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed, it was a chip. And he's running like a moose right now. <laughs> and the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Why would they do that? How many times do we have to explain it to you? It saves the clock, dumbass. Second down, and they take their first time out. Uh, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the timeout during halftime. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Remember, folks, in the NFL, you are allowed to touch the quarterback, just like that. <laughs> the damned walk away victorious today. The entire game was trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered, but in the end, their 
there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that a feeder team should get a participation award because you know, I tried really hard. Why don't you try real hard to shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the scouts, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the game's MVP. Yeah, man, I was hanging on the now. You know what Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...